joining welcome to vlogmas part two i am so excited to do vlogmas this year i have never done vlogmas before because i only started vlogging regularly this summer so here we are i'm not going to vlog daily but i want to share some typical traditional things that we do here in the netherlands or with my family during the holidays and i was thinking about ideas for videos and i couldn't think of that much and then I realized that tonight we are going to do one of the most Dutch things ever, which is Hulmetten. And I never realized that this was was a Dutch thing actually, but I asked my parents and they said, yes, it is. I'm going to get ready and then I'm going to tell you a little bit more about this tradition and why we do it every year. I don't even know why we do it every year, but it is really fun. And uh, yeah, I am going to get ready and then... I need to prepare some food so I can tell you a little bit about it before showing it. It's basically when you are sitting around a table and in the middle of the table you have this kind of electric grill and everyone can put their... Normally it's with a lot of, a lot of meat, a lot of animal products, so meat and egg and but also vegetables on your grill and you have your own little pen and then you are just spending a lot of time chatting trying different foods and grilling your own foods and yeah it's just really fun and it is something that we do every christmas eve this year we're going to do it on the first day of christmas but yeah every christmas eve and we always do it on the around the 5th of december so this year it's going to be the fourth always around this time and it is really fun this yeah i'm just going to show you but i do need to prepare a lot of food Normally it's with a lot of meat, so I need to, well, my mom and I make sure that I have nice things as well. So I'm going to get ready really quick and then I am going to show you what hurmethan is and we're going to prepare the food together, so. Right, this is my full outfit. And you may be wondering, if this is a holiday, then why are you wearing a big hoodie? Well, Hurmette is going to make your whole place smell like food, including your clothes. A sweater is perfect. This is actually a like a suit, but I am cold right now, so I have a sweater on top. I'm going downstairs now and see what my mom is doing, and then I think we are going to prepare everything for our Hurmette evening. Oh, I don't even know how to explain, but I will show you. Right, this is what our Hormetstel looks like. This is just electric, so you will just plug it in and then here you can decide the heat. And then you can grill here. We're just going to put some oil or butter, I'm not sure, uh, on the grill. And then everyone can put their pieces of meat or meat replacements here. And then everyone has this little grill pen or like a mini pen and you can put them right there this is what I have for me I'm going to cut this into little pieces I also have some vegan nuggets and some veggie sticks I think now I'm going to make my famous <laughs> garlic sauce mm -hmm. and garlic butter. And And oh yeah. Yes. Thank you. 
going to show you everything that is mine. So here we have vegan nuggets. And then here I have some veggies. Here we have some vegan veggie sticks. All of the sauce and some mushrooms. A lot, a lot of food. Yeah. It's not healthy, but it's really fun. I'm going to introduce you to the head of the party committee. Hello. It's mommy. Hi. Hi. Hi, guys. <laughs> it's your new year. <laughs> <laughs> She's making fun of me. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Oli! Okay, now. Gummies! Ah! This is the cutest dog alive. Oli, are you happy? Are you a happy dog? You make me a very happy dog owner. <laughs> Do you think you also get a present? I think not. <laughs> Oli is also getting a present because he's been a very good boy. Who's a good, good boy? boy? An excellent dog. Last but not least. <laughs> This is all vegan. It's the next day and I am about to end this video. I hope you guys like seeing this typical Dutch tradition and I wanted to show that even though some traditions are super non-vegan, you can still make them vegan and it is still possible to enjoy dinner with people even though you don't have the same dietary preferences. And yeah, I would love to know what kind of traditions you have in your country. So let me know in the comments and if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you in the next Vlogmas video.